As you guys know, Chris is the biggest simp in the sink. He's just the biggest simp. I don't know why he's the simp, but he just is the simp. So on the podcast, Indiana wanted to go on this fake date. Tonight. We should make a YouTube video a day, a, yeah. like a day of us Chris, dating. would you be cool with that? You are cool. so fucking He's so welcome. down. <laughs> He's so down. So me and Nathan planned this fake date without Chris even knowing. And it all started with us making him cook a meal. He had no idea what it was for, but we just made him. So let's just get straight into the video. Woo! Fuck, I had to do stuff. What? What? Why didn't you guys like tell me that I left shit on the fucking? Bro, you're gonna burn her chicken, really? Back up, bitch. Yeah, the sauces. Why are you using that white creamy sauce when you use the other type? Uh, uh. Why are you trying to make it sexy? <laughs> well, I got a new condom for your date, buddy. Yeah. Talk about Look at this fucking heater. Half your dick in here, buddy. Look at that bad boy. See, that's what I'm talking. That's here. confidence. Hey, you want to try it up? That's confidence. Yeah, I'll All be right. back. Okay, you'll try this all cooked for you while you're done. Thank you. Yeah, he has no idea where we're taking him. I have no idea, but you know what? I know this meal is going to get me good places. The fuck are you guys taking me? Bro. Just fucking thank us later, dude. Like, we're literally doing a good deed. We're literally doing a good deed for you. When do you guys ever do good deeds for me? Man, it better not be a waste of time, bro. <laughs> like, what, what, what could you be doing right now? Sleeping? Jerking off, sleeping, <laughs> Fortnite. <laughs> bro, why the fuck do you have me here? What the fuck is this? It's Dude. cold as fuck. It's cold as bricks. Do you have your picnic ready? Picnic for what? There's just lake. For your date. With who? You'll find out. All right, I'll go get the picnic. Surprise? Yeah, man. I'm ready for it. My boy Chris! Oh my gosh! <laughs> <laughs> I'm so excited to see you. <laughs> Holy shit! All right. We're going on a little date. Yeah, I got some pasta here. You made us some pasta? Yeah, yeah. I got some forks. Got some forks. Mm. Got some. Wheat thins. Tr I love wheat thins. Actually, these are my favorite. No, I was thinking of you when I got them. Little wheat thin. Oh, and some Twizzlers, guys. We're fucking set. Are you happy you left the house? You know, seeing a real life woman, you know, <laughs> instead of like, yeah. So the ones on Fortnite? Yeah. They got bigger asses than me, so you might be a little disappointed. You're on a date with your dream girl. How you feeling? I'm great. You know, this is a great day. January 25th, March is in the books. One of the greatest days of my life. I've actually never been on a date, weirdly. This is your first one? Yeah, every ex I've ever had never took me on a date, so you're already doing better than them. That's what I'm saying. I like, I wouldn't necessarily be like, oh fuck, I love Twizzlers. But like, I also wouldn't necessarily be like, fuck Twizzlers. My mom loves Twizzlers. Me and your mom have something in common? Yeah. Do I meet your mom soon? Um, shit, I gotta meet her first. <laughs> <laughs> Indiana, you said Chris is losing his chances with you every, every day. Yeah. Okay. Every time I meet him, or meet up with him, he loses his chances. Yeah, because every time she meets me, I have a fucked up haircut because nobody tells me she's coming over. <laughs> Alright? So I never get a fucking haircut. The first time I was over, you brought up Megan. You forced me to with a question. <laughs> you forced me to with a question. But you answered Look, incorrectly. Guys, their first argument. You answered incorrectly. <laughs> it was a joke. I answered like uh, to get you angry. So you want to get me angry? No, that was a joke back then. But you got up and walked away, which is very immature. It's not immature. <laughs> if you're gonna start talking to me about it and talking to me about another girl that you like, then why am I gonna sit there you and take the it? Question. Uh, you asked the question. I gave you the answer. But it was a joke. So you're joking with my heart. You're gonna play with me now? You play with my heart all the fucking time. I don't play with your heart all the time. What? I'm very direct and honest with you. I believe last time you asked me to be honest with you, and I said, Chris, it's not gonna happen. Yeah. And, and now, now we're, we're here. We're at. And we're here. It's gonna happen. So. Oh, this actually smells really good. All right, ready? We're gonna do a taste test. Yeah. It's actually pretty good. Get you a man who can cook. Get you a man who can cook. It's actually really good. Oh, ah, all right, Chris. Well, I just earned some points. How many points? Good five. How much did I lose last time we met? Good 10. Wait, this is actually really good. Why is it so good? 
because I cooked it. Like, I'm a fucking goat. I don't know what to tell you. Well, things start, Chris. Uh, How did you discover me? One day, Kai said there was a new High Pass member. Mm. Yeah. Is that how you discovered me? And then he showed me a picture and I was like, ooh, damn, girl, like, go ahead or something like that. And that was my raw reaction. I saw that video, it actually came up on my For You page. It showed up on my For You page, and I was like, what? Like, it was just these guys, like, starting to talk about me, and I think I commented on it, and I was like, I think I said, like, what's up, Chris, or whatever. And you got that on, like, you got that on camera, and you're like, yo, Indiana responded to the video, and I was like, holy shit, this is the funniest thing, and then you guys asked me to be on the podcast. And that was like, dude, we had so much fun. Can you drive, Chris? Huh? Can you drive? Mm -mm. You can't drive? No. Like you? I can physically, but like, no, I can't. It's been great. Sweetie. How old are you, Chris? I'm 20. I got my license when I was like 16. Well, I'm a lazy fuck. <laughs> All right, guess I'll have to teach you how to fucking drive. That'd be actually sick. Not Next in my video. car. Not in my damn car. I won't crash it. I won't crash it. Have you had the opportunity to yeah. crash a car? Several. Paper, scissors, rock. Paper, scissors, rock. <laughs> what are the odds you jump in the pond right now? I'm not jumping in this fucking pond. I'm not jumping in this pond. It would make me so happy. You know what? You know what? Fuck your happiness right now because I'm not jumping in that pond. When are you thinking we're going to get married? Married? Probably when I have enough money just to like literally give it away. I can't get like, you know, tied up when I'm broke, you know? So you don't want to be tied up to me? No, oh, of course. Where do you want to move? Move. I'm thinking Calabasas. At least Calabasas? You, know. you got Calabasas money? I don't got Calabasas money. Indiana, what is your nickname for Chris? What is my nickname for Chris? It's usually like loser, pathetic. Maybe a babe? A babe? A babe? Yeah, babe. I like the babe. I don't like baby. Baby's like weird. Yeah. You what about like, like, like daddy? <laughs> normalizes the word daddy no let's not normalize i feel like it's the opposite i feel like we should normalize girls dealing with their daddy issues and not just turning them into sexual fetishes <sighs> oh this is great this is my favorite part of the day just watching the ducks yeah i know you should probably date that duck that duck me. is getting it get into it let's say that you got to get to like 10 points right and then i points. lost five on the first date so you lost five on the first date. i gained two over there with like the the but you just lost like 10. i just lost 10. what if i told you it was a joke so you're like i'm gonna say like a solid negative 10 right now that's fine that's fine you know what that's fine with you i'm good in the clutch it's fine <laughs> hey there's a bullshit <laughs> So, so one more thing we had to do yeah. for your uh, face forward, face forward, face forward right make here. Make it public. Online. Oh, oh my god! So we called a friend up uh, from the Hollywood Fix. Shut the fuck up! He's Shut the fuck up! You didn't do this. <laughs> yeah, we did. So enjoy your interview with Fletcher. Shut the fuck up! Guys, what is going on today? Man, Mister, what the hell, man? This is the hottest new couple right here.